Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, this week we're going to be planning for July 15th to the 21st. Um, I did put a little bit of washi down just to cover these like black strips because I thought that would be kind of cute. And so um, I'm going to show you the kit really quick. It's from Anne's Prints this week. And this one is called Lush and I just thought it was beautiful and summery and... I will share this kit with you really quickly. This is made specifically for a happy planner, so it should fit perfectly. Um, here's our full boxes, uh, glitter, washi, um, and I'm gonna definitely use this because that's adorable. We got our deco page, our heart check boxes, um, bottom washi date covers, extra washi strips, habit trackers, and then you have your functional page. Um, I don't exactly remember what this page is called. And then I threw in uh, the date dots that she had sent me. So, we are going to get started. Um, I'm actually going to do the date dots first because otherwise I forget. Because, you know, that's how my brain works. So, and I usually do this off camera just because it saves a little bit of time. And I feel like watching me put on some date covers is kind of boring but I forgot to this week honestly so we're just gonna do it on camera and 21 okay I'm just gonna get started with the bottom washi and the date covers and all that. Um, today is Sunday. Oops, there's that one. And where'd the other one go? Oh. Oh, they're on the same sheet. What am I doing? Um, but yeah, today is Sunday the 7th, technically. Um, I did not have to work today, so I actually slept in. And it was, oh, it was amazing. I haven't slept in for a little bit. So, I just felt really good just to be able to actually just sleep in. And I don't actually have to work for the next two days, which is weird. Um, so, I'm going to run around and get all my errands done tomorrow. I have to go to the bank and go to grocery shopping and, you know, just do normal stuff. Adulting stuff. <laughs> probably film this today and then edit it tomorrow I am getting better at editing you guys I am trying I have a program that I've been using um, and I've been like tinkering with it just like making like little stupid videos or like just taking videos of my cats because they're funny <laughs> and so I've been taking videos of them and just like playing around with my editor which I feel like is the only way I'm ever gonna get better so, yep, that's what I'm going to do. And then yesterday, yesterday was Saturday, yeah, Saturday. And we went to the lake after I got out of work and watched some fireworks with some friends. So that was a good time. And my son had a blast. He loves fire watching fireworks on the lake. There's really nothing like it. It's beautiful. So I was glad that we got to experience that. And then yesterday was a super slow work day, but a really super heavy prep day. So I just prepped my little heart out. And um, yeah, so that's pretty much it for yesterday. I just prepped <laughs> all day long. It was kind of nice. It was relaxing. Just turn on some music and just work. And we had orders every once in a while, but I had another co-worker there, and she was like, I'll cook tonight. I'm like, okay. So I just stayed over in my little side of the kitchen and prepped my little heart out, and that was it. And then today, I literally, I, I cleaned the entire house Friday, and I was like, I'm literally going to do nothing on Sunday except for film. Because my leg has been killing me. Um... I think I've mentioned before that I have to have a double knee replacement, but they won't even look at me until I'm in my 40s. And so I've just been just kind of dealing with the pain. Um, 
and there's really nothing anybody can do because I broke my knee when I was 15 and so I have a really really bad arthritis and it's just painful and that's pretty much it that's all that they can really do for me is just that because I can't take blood thinner or I can't take a lot of different medication because I'm on my blood thinners and so they try to give me Motrin but I can't take Motrin because I'm on blood thinners and yeah I put down this washi right here and I guess I really didn't need it because I didn't think about the full box so I'm just gonna cut it right here and then pull it up there we go Just trying to get this to line up as best as I can, which I feel like that went pretty well. The last time I had a double box like this, I feel like I placed it like three or four times because I couldn't get it to place where I wanted, but I feel like that placed very, very well. I hope everybody had an amazing fourth. I, uh, I had the 4th of July off too because we closed the restaurant at 2. Um, the morning was super hectically busy, I guess. Um, I didn't actually have to work. And so, but they said it was just slammed because I guess we were the only restaurant open in town. Um, so I was like, damn. <laughs> but they did not have to call me in, so that's awesome. My other co worker who works down there, he's a very damn good cook. And he handled it like a champ. That's awesome. I put my washi, like my orange strip washi right here. I feel like I put that on really crooked. So now my headers are going to be crooked. But I might actually go back over that with one more strip of washi. Just because I want that orange to kind of show through. I thought it would look nice with the colors that are in the flowers in the full boxes and kind of break up some of this green a little bit because there is a lot of green going on. And don't get me wrong, green is my favorite color, but you need to break it up a little bit, give it a little pop. So yeah, I don't have anything really to even talk about. I'm just chilling and relaxing and living life to my best ability. My son's outside right now playing football with the neighbor kids. I can I can see him out the window. And man, that kid has an arm on him. I wish he would play sports, honestly, but he is like, he's not interested in sports. He's more of a bookworm. He loves to read. He actually um, went down to the library the other day and got two library books. I want to say, what day was it? Tuesday? Maybe? Oh, it's either Monday or Tuesday, I can't remember. And he's gotten them both read because I. I found some books or like a box of books at a yard sale and they wanted like five dollars and there was like I don't know 50 60 books in there and they're all chapter books and so I just bought the whole box well he's interested in one of the series that's in the box but it came with box or it came with book two and four but not one and three so he went to the library and he got book one and three and he's already had he already got them read <laughs> So, but he's really enjoying the series. I don't remember exactly what it's called, but um, he's really enjoying it, so that's all that matters to me. And it keeps him off the damn phone. I, kids and technology nowadays, man. Drives me nuts. Like, if he's going somewhere, going on a bike ride or something like that, I he takes his phone with him. 
just in case anything happens or whatever. I'm fine with him having his phone, but I hate that when he stays on his phone all day. I'm like, hey, it's beautiful outside. Go outside and ride your bike or play football or basketball or whatever. Or, you know, hell, even take your book outside. And go read outside. Just and go outside and enjoy the weather. Because here in Michigan, we get about eight months of winter. We have like a month of spring. <laughs> Like a month of fall, <laughs> a couple months of summer, and that's it. Like so, enjoy it while it lasts because it's gonna get cold again soon. It starts getting cold here, um, mid October, I want to say. Last year, it seems like it got cold, colder faster, because I think we had snow on Halloween last year. Um, so yeah. I can enjoy it. Go outside. Be a kid. Um, he came to work Friday night, but it was so hot and humid outside that um, he couldn't take it for the whole shift. So um, we made him come inside and sit down and drink some water because he was bright red and he is asthmatic. So we're like, come and sit down, chill out, you know, catch your breath, which I always, he always carries his rescue inhaler on him just in case. Which I'm glad he did that day because he definitely needed it. Okay, time for some full boxes. Which I think is kind of funny because I'm like, go outside and read and that's yeah, kind of what this is. I go outside and read all the time and just go sit out on the balcony. I'm trying to decide what full box I want for up here. Which I kind of want to do that one because I think that's my favorite one all of, out of all of them. <clears throat> Sorry if I'm kind of mumbling today. My throat is like on fire. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to actually cover up the July, which I never do. I'm going to start this up higher. Because I'm going to try something. I just want to try something new. You got to change up your planning style every once in a while. Otherwise it just gets boring, right? Okay, so there's that one full box, and then we'll just do the rest of them sporadically, I guess. Um, so I have one here, so I'll do one here and one here. Nope, I guess we're doing it this way. I guess with my HP like sticker kits. I don't really need to put that strip down because it gets covered anyways. So, oh well. We'll just keep that upside down for a minute. Um, that's a lot of white, that's a lot of white, that's a lot of white. So I'm going to use this one in here. Good golly, Miss Molly. boyfriend's out there watching NASCAR and doing his laundry which we've been getting along a little bit better lately so it's it's been nice but for a while there it was a little bit of a struggle you know how relationships can be sometimes right it's definitely they're definitely work sometimes which I expect them to be. I don't expect a relationship to be perfect and all that. But sometimes you, I just kind of wish like it was. <laughs> I love these flowers. They're so pretty. Okay, so there's our full boxes. I actually have two extra, so I might use them for deco 
or on a day that I don't specifically do a whole lot. Um, so I'm just going to set those off to the side and then I'll just use an extra full box for that. I'm going to work on my sidebar really quickly. Um, let's see, I'm trying to find my Monday right here and my habit trackers, which are right here, which is kind of perfect. Okay. So for that, I'm going to use green. And then my three habit trackers, as usual. I'm going to use a blue one now. To separate those for my dinners. Um, oops, it came off. There we go. I kind of wish I would have put my. I love that these stickers are so easy to pull up. Sometimes they make the stickers so darn sticky that they're super hard to like pull up or reposition. So it's really nice that it's easy. Um, I'm just going to, where did that go? Here it is. like so, and then maybe I'll use an extra full box down here. What am I? Use pink. Am I in frame? Yes, I am, okay. And then we're gonna add this one. And I'll just have to trim it down a little bit, but I'll save the bottom part of or whatever I, I cut off here and I'll save it for like background washi. Grab my scissors, which my son always takes my scissors and he never puts them back in the right spot. <laughs> here and now my check heart boxes I feel like I haven't been using my check heart boxes as much lately um, so I was kind of thinking maybe I wouldn't put them down unless I needed them but I kind of feel naked without it what do you guys think I think this week I will put them down as I need them. And then um, one thing that I was talking about last week, I believe, was I kind of want to try doing vo voiceover. So maybe if I just lay down the base and then if I need to put a check heart sticker down, sticker, sticker down, I can. But um, I think I am going to end it here. Um, that was quick and it was easy, right? Actually, before I do that, I do know that I have a few things going on this week. Um, so I will throw some stickers on here really quick for those. Like I'm going to watch my master chef, which I didn't actually watch this week yet. After NASCAR, maybe I can talk my boyfriend into ordering some pizza and watching some master chef. Cause I honestly, I don't want to cook today. Last or er, this week has been so humid and so muggy that it's been literally miserable 
to go outside. Like it's the hot air doesn't bother me. Like I don't mind the hot temps. Um, it's like today it's hot, but it's not muggy today. So it's bearable. Um, I don't like going out there and just like feeling like you get punched right in the gut. That's not fun for me. So I'm going to take my foiled stickers from Luxy Kits Design or Lucky Luxy. <sighs> Lux Kitty Designs. I cannot speak today. I'm so sorry, Jessica. Um, but I am going to take um, two of these foiled stickers. And actually, I went out and bought me a little handy dandy little pair of tweezers. And I was looking for like the longer pairs, but I could not find them anywhere. But what really bothered me was like these were the cheapest pair I could find. And I figured that they didn't really have to be super expensive just to be picking up stickers. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> These little things, these ones were like two bucks, but the other ones I was looking at, they're like exactly like these, only they were um, like a different color or something. And they wanted like 12 bucks for them. I'm like $12 for a pair of little tweezers? You kidding me? Hell no. And then um, my boyfriend actually found these ones. So I'm gonna do a trick that I um, seen another YouTuber do. She covers up um, the white icon or whatever. Um, so technically I didn't have to use the TV icons, but, um, she takes the ends of like the little thing stickers. She cuts off a little bit of it and then she takes and she places it over the top of whatever icon it is. If she's going to put her own sticker down. Um, and I thought that was kind of ingenious. So that was, uh, I think that's a good way for me to start using up the stickers that I don't use in each kit. If I can find light colors for each kit, I think that's what I'm going to start doing. Cause I think that's a really good idea to use your stickers. So anyways, I found these, these like little tweezers because I don't have nails now. Um, and actually I kind of do I have to cut them, but, um, yeah two bucks for these ones instead of 12 and I'm like I'll pay two dollars I just don't want to pay twelve dollars that's insane to me but yeah all right so that's Master Chef that's Master Chef I can fill this out with you guys really quickly um, I'm just gonna use the blue navy pen that I have right here because I was using it to fill in um, my fourth of July week um, so this is going to be blood thinners as usual. This is my face routine. I just had a brain fart. <laughs> and then this is going to be, what is my third one? Other vitamins and meds. Okay, and that's dinners. This is Master Chef. This is also Master Chef. I almost wrote Chef Master. Okay. And actually, on this day, I know that John does have a doctor's appointment. So, um, let me stick that down really quickly. Um, only this is what she does is she turns the icons a different way. Only she does white space, and I don't. Um, but her name is J. Rue Plans, I want to say. I can't remember exactly because I just found her and I really enjoy her show or her channel. Um, I found her from Scribble Prince Co. because she was always talking about um, Jessica. <laughs> and so I had to see who this Jessica was and see her planning style because everybody has different planning styles, which is why I love planners. And I love watching everybody else's, even though some of their planning styles aren't my cup of tea. Um, they're really enjoyable to watch. So, And then, oh, on this day too, my, my nephew has a... No, hold on. It's Sunday. <laughs> it's Sunday. My nephew has a birthday, so I can actually use a birthday sticker. So I'm just going to put a little stethoscope foiled icon there, and then... Um, let's see, I will use a green sticker because I haven't used one of these yet. Come on, 
There we go. And then I will cover the little TV up. I think someone just came in. I just heard my front door open and shut and close. I'm not even going to bother with the tweezers. Although the tweezers do help, I want to say. Okay. And I finally get to use one of these beautiful um, birthday stickers, which I'm super excited about. And that's going to go right there. All right. I think that's it now, for real. <laughs> so here it is, guys. Um, I really love this kit. I really love how the colors work to really well together. I love this little pop of like a corally orange in there. I think that added a nice touch to it and kind of elevated it. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to try to do a voiceover and plan this whole week on camera, but I'm not really sure how that's going to work. I haven't quite figured that out yet, but I'm going to try it. So uh, stay tuned for that, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.